Miss energy. Yeah. You know what I mean? We have it there. Felicia has too much energy on a Friday night. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> kicking off the weekend with it. Well, some places with like a rumble and yeah, a bang across portions of Texas. Has a lot of energy too. Th that's not that's not in my plans. No rumble, no bang. Let's talk about uh, where you have Lake. This makes sense for people who live very close to Lake. I mean, growing, I remember right? I was like getting the boat to go right? right up and then hooking it and then cranking it. I mean, it's a process. Or like imagine being like a young Stephanie Abrams and some okay. guy's like, hey, Steph, you want to come join me on the boat this weekend? You're like, yes. And he's like, okay, I'll pick you up on Saturday morning and, and he shows and ride it all right the future of sustainable travel is here actually it's in the Netherlands but if all goes well this could be in America very soon listen to this this set of 32 steel tubes recently opened in the Netherlands eats do a little rotation oh. because of the, the g-force or whatever so it helps with that. I'm not even claustrophobic for some reason that gets tube? me a little claustrophobic. Well think about it. you're in a plane you're in a, a I tube. I know I know but for some Flying reason 500 miles an hour, I need to make sure there's some way that you can get out of it if it ends up getting stuck. I guess there could be like a door that you come out and then you could crawl out the top yeah. of the tube or something like that. Hopefully, yeah. but can you imagine cool, getting there that's that fast. quick? That's fast, yeah. All right, cruise lines are going green. Another way to travel. Sailing sustainably. Come sail away. Come sail. We need I that, like that right? song, too. That's a good one. Uh, climate, of course, still remains a concern here. The cruise industry aims to set sail towards bluer skies and cleaner seas. Good. We're getting a closer look at how some of the world's biggest cruise lines are working to reach huge milestones in the next 20 years. As our partners at Local Now show us, the biggest goal reaching net zero, carbon cruising cruise because I've absolutely never done it it was a thing that just I don't know we mm -hmm. never cruised or whatever but yeah I mean I, I've got friends that it's like that's what they do that's the all only yeah the I have time. the same that's they the only way we absolutely way they love it and of course it helps if you're next to a port town where they launch yeah, from so exactly all right let's have a look at the weather can't tell you last time I changed a light bulb really yeah, I feel like my light, our light bulbs never go out. They must be well, LED. Yes, once you put in the LED, they last a lot longer yeah. than the other type. So you probably have already changed them, and now you're good to go for a long time. Literally could never Do you have the you. low flow? I tried the low flow. When I was living in Texas, they were big into putting all the residents because we had a huge water shortage and a big drought. Mm -hmm. And I did it on, you know, where I'd wash my hands and stuff like that, which it really does help a lot. And it's still, you've got the nice spray, so it just How doesn't How do you put even put it on low flow? Oh, you just twist off. There's a little. All right, everybody. You want to know what's coming up Monday? It's I Earth do. Day here on Pattern. Listen to this. Young Stephanie Brown. Guys like, hey, Steph, you want to come join me on the boat this weekend? You're like, yes. And he's like, okay, I'll pick you. And ride it. All right. The future of sustainable travel is here. Actually, it's in the Netherlands, but of all...